it is really worrying. It is like a, it is like a death cult, uh, like in the, in the similar vein that the Republicans have become like a death cult over the vaccine stuff. The idea that people are cheering on, uh, oh, shit, you guys didn't have a video for that. I'm sorry. The idea that, um, the idea that leftists are like cheering on the crazy dude for the self immolation is insane, is unhinged. Like the guy was clearly unwell. And if he wasn't mentally unwell, then he was just a fucking moron. Like, they're also greenlighting terrorist attacks on Twitter. I'm hoping this is just like a minority opinion, maybe. Um, like, this is unhinged. Reminder that plane hijackings used to be perfectly normal and were mostly nonviolent. 9 11 was an outlier in the first of its kind. What the fuck? 240 quotes, though. Yeah, there are other. Tw what was the one tweet that I responded to? You can't protest peacefully. You can't boycott. You can't hunger strike. You can't hijack planes. You can't block traffic. You can't throw Molotovs. You can't self immolate. You can't heckle politicians. You can't march. You can't write. You can't dissent. You ca just can't be. That's it. They're also getting tarred and feathered hard in the replies. No one agrees with them. The guy with the 15,000 likes on his tweet? Okay. Listen, uh, as a quick thing. These people deserve to be bullied, okay? You should not encourage people to set themselves on fire for shit like this. It's fucking unhinged and it's fucking retarded, okay? This is not a noble thing. It's not a good thing. It's stupid. Why would you fucking do this? The reason why people do insane fucking protests like this, where you set yourself on fire, where you do hunger strikes or whatever, is because you literally have no other avenue to communicate your voice. There's either suppression of the media, or you don't, or you live in a dictatorship, or you're locked in prison under lock and key, and you've got no way to communicate. This is when people resort to these measures because there's no other way to make their voices heard. Self-immolating in a democracy is the most retarded fucking thing you can do. It's like starving to death in a Baskin Robbins. What the is wrong with you go vote go on social media there's a billion other things you can do to make your voice heard literally nothing will change because this guy killed himself other than there's one less retarded fucking voter in the world like that's it he's removed himself from the voting pool if anything if anything the only thing he managed to do by setting himself on fire is hurt his cause by one vote it's retarded don't encourage people to do like this it's stupid do you not feel like the news story would net him more than one voter at least is anybody changing their mind is anybody seeing this like man i kind of thought israel was in the moral right to defend themselves from Hamas, but when that retarded 25-year-old Reddit anarchy poster set himself on fire screaming in that lively Twitter video, I'm kind of I'm kind of feeling differently about it now. Like, wow. Maybe Israel should stop. Yeah, yeah, that's what I believe. Also, don't you dare say rest in power. That's for black people only. <laughs> Seems recently you've been kind of blowing up. Example of the Pierce Morgan thing. Do you think it's the Israel-Palestine stuff? Were you blowing up before? Um, no, I think it was before. The Israel-Palestine stuff has probably actually slowed down my ability to capitalize off the recent stuff. But we'll be okay when we come back. I wanted to do this. What, um, there is no, where's the forethought post? The idolization of Aaron Bushnell by leftists is totally expected and is completely acceptable. There is... No evidence for having mental illness. He wanted his suicide to be as visible as possible, which is why he live streamed it. Explicitly and repeatedly stated the cause that it was for. Irrational extreme action are not mutually exclusive. This is not new. Do not f***ing story point to, oh my god, he was in Bad Bunny's chat, as if being in anyone's Twitch chat, podcast, or Patreon exclusive Discord will give you the desire to self-immolate. And say he was an idiot, but I'm trying to take away this man's agency over the most trivial and frivolous shit. His suicide was an explicitly political statement. Expecting people that share his beliefs to not valorize him for the most extreme acts of peaceful protest a human being can commit is beyond a doubt. I'm not wasting time arguing over his mental state unless you have evidence and no, saying so far is not enough. Wait, what? Is any part of this satire? Or I can't tell. Am I just... The idolization of Aaron Bushnell by leftists is totally expected and is completely acceptable. Do we think it's... Is it acceptable to idolize somebody who commits suicide for a political cause? Is that... When we, mean, when we say acceptable, what do we mean there, I guess? I mean, like, it's technically, it's your life. I mean, if you really want to kill yourself, it's fine, I guess. But is it terrorism, though? No, it's not terrorism. Ugh. You killed that man! You pulled your guns out and set a goddamn fire extinguishers! You pulled your guns out and set a fire extinguishers! You pulled your guns out and set a fire extinguishers! You killed that man! Shit. You killed that man! Hey. You killed Aaron Bushnell! You did! All of you! All of you f***ing pigs and war criminals! You killed that man! You killed
from where he died. Do you feel the flames? We died in the training. Do you feel the flames yet? He died. <laughs> <laughs> Do you feel the flames yet? No fucking shame. Exactly where you're standing. Exactly where you're standing. A man burned to death. Quit your job. 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 Oh, what? Okay. Boom, boom. That tweet was unhinged. I couldn't help it. I'm sorry. I got there's. I just saw so much on Twitter. I couldn't help it. I couldn't help it. There's actually so many movie scenes you could draw. You could just have like a thumbs up. Thumbs up free Palestine. Um. <laughs> what would it be? Oh, it would be like when I ask my friend if he supports Palestine and then you would just like post his picture. Oh, f that'd be a good meme. I have to stop. I have so many of these. My brain. Okay, I'm not tweeting these. Talk about this. As a streamer myself for almost six years now, on how hard it really is. <laughs> no, I'm actually, I'm, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I would look. I, I just. Oh God, it's just like. What's funny is you haven't even addressed this again since then. I know. It's just an opportunity for every single person to be like, "Look, guys, I'm a content creator. I'm." Wait, did I miss something, or what did he say? about this as a streamer myself for almost six years now on how hard it really is <laughs> no, I'm actually I'm, I'm kidding I'm kidding I would look I, I just oh it's never mind I I was fixing it right on the wrong thing I got it okay wait oh. that wait this is what he's <laughs> wait uh, okay. I okay I okay I thought there was something like more insidious in here I got it oh god it's just like what's funny <laughs> wait how long is he about to go mauled over this comment wait what you haven't even addressed this again since then i know it's just an opportunity for every single person to be like look guys i'm a content creator i'm really privileged like yeah dog we all we all are we all talk about it all the time it just annoys me because like it's such a fake thing to do it's just literally using someone who you're friends with like being maliciously clipped out of context to be like I'm actually one of the good content creators. I know how privileged I am. It's like, yeah, I do too. That's so fucking dumb. Oh my God. Like, ay ay ay. It's like no different than what Muda did. He showed the context though. It doesn't fucking matter that he showed the context. It's just a way to just literally farm off the fucking drama. Frankly, yeah, no, no video for Nick Marks from Ludwig. Uh, you know, cause eh. I think it's dumb. Okay. Dream and these people have to deal with it law. <sighs> can I just say also just real quick, can I just because I don't think you understand like how much of a like selfish rat f piece of shit Hassan is, okay? Hassan is expecting, right? He has the expectation that these guys are going to throw out a life raft for him when he's committing optic suicide, okay? That these guys are going to stake their reputation on throwing a life raft out for him. When he sat there and he basically ridiculed Ethan for being upset that his entire, that Hassan's entire fan base was calling him basically a fucking messy. With Hassan being like, well, I don't know what I can do. I don't know what I can do. I don't know. I can't do anything about that. And now he's over here rolling around like a baby who's shit his diaper twice with nobody to change it, crying that all of these other streamers aren't throwing out life rafts to help Hassan because he can't fucking control himself for more than two weeks without saying something else retarded. Jesus.